Okay, let's start off with today's topic. We are going to cover technical analysis in brief and we are going to have some query sessions after that in today. Today's topics will be basic technical analysis. My screen is clear to everybody. You all can see the screen. Okay. My name is Ankita Jain. I have been in stock market for approximately seven years and been associated with Prudent Academy. Earlier, I used to give trading intraday based calls in Prudent Academy. Then I was a part-time faculty at St. Xavier's College, Kolkata, MB Institutes there, Prudent Academy there. And now I'm giving some online classes to you. So let's start off. So the screen as well as my voice is clear, right? Can we start off? Okay. Let's start off with what is technical analysis. In stock market, there is there are two kind of studies which goes on. One is fundamental analysis, one is technical analysis. While fundamental analysis is more about going through the balance sheet, the PL account, the cash flow statement of a company, trying to find out that whether a company is overvalued, whether a company is undervalued. So when we are doing fundamental analysis, we are going through the different ratios of the company, how the company is performing, the net profit of the company, the cash flow from operations of the company, the competitive advantage the company has. So a lot of qualitative and quantitative aspects of that company is taken into account. And after make, taking these ratios and analyzing in depth the prof PL and the balance sheet of the company, we try to find out whether this company is undervalued or overvalued. If we find this company undervalued, then we buy this company. And when we find that this company is overvalued, that means the market has already valued this company more than its actual value then we try, try to book profits on that particular company. But there are two schools of thought. Fundamental when we are going is more about going through PL and balance sheet. Technical on the other hand, hand is going through the pra past price movements of the stock through a graphical representation in the form of charts. Now technical analysis is predicting the future price movements of a stock by trying to find out or seeing the past price data. While fundamental analysis is more about long term investments, when we are taking the stock based on fundamental analysis, it's more about taking the stock for at least a horizon of one to two years and keeping the stock till its true value is captured by the market. But when it comes to technical analysis, we are more into short term trading. That is a, a weekly trading could be there, a positional three day trading could be there, and intraday trading could be there. Intraday trading means trading when you buy a stock today itself and sell off today itself. In that case, you say that this is 
intraday trading similarly suppose in the morning you sell a or short a stock selling another word for selling is also shorting the stock so when you are shorting a stock and then buying it back again that particular day itself then it is called that it is intraday trading again there is a concept called positional trading what does positional trading mean that you have bought a stock today and you don't sell it off today itself you say for example keep it for 2 to 3 days or maybe a week and after that one week or 3 to 4 days you sell that stock so that is called positional trading even if you are buying the stock say for one month that is also a form of positional trading so this technical analysis has a lot of concepts which we are going to try and understand in today's class so for people who do not want to keep their stock for one or two years and keep trading or keep buying and selling stocks regularly for them understanding technical analysis is very very important okay so let's understand what that again trading can also be done for 5 minutes from a 15 minute chart we are going to understand the concept of chart as we go on what is a chart 